She's a news producer at NBC. By night, she's a wanted comedian and sketch performer with Soul Sister Comedy. You can follow her, follow her on Instagram at Bar Comedy. That's P A B A R C O N E D Y. Please welcome. Hello. I swear to God, 
Jack. This dog is like a little puppy angel. Oh. He's like a toy. He's so fucking perfect. We love him. He's the light of our little lives. He's just a joke. Do you believe me? If you don't believe me, pick up your phones, go to Instagram, and look up the little puppy. And I too know the puppy. This dog is just a cloud of joy. Try to train this dog. It's a lesson in life. <laughs> It's a learning to be patient, to take long walks, and commune with your dog. Commune with your partner about, did your dog pee? Did it poop? Did you take a poop? Did you call him? Okay, hey, what's your dog? Oh, you're good? Did your dog poop? Did your dog poop? Did you poop twice? What did you eat? Did you pee? Did you put water in a bowl? Did you pee? Did you poop? Did you poop? Did you poop outside? Have you looked? Are you sure? I think he pooped. He has to poop. He has to pee. He has to poop. So that's us. to see if he's going to use the bathroom outside. <laughs> we can walk him for 45 minutes to an hour, and he will still come inside the house and find a way to shit where we're not looking. This dog's nickname is the shit ninja. Because that's how stealthy it is in taking up the unseen shit as soon as we're not looking. But when it comes to this dog, he's so fucking cute, we don't care. <laughs> This dog, like, I literally turn into Becky when I'm around this dog. My boyfriend is six foot one, at least 175 pounds. He turns into Brad. We are Brad and Becky. <laughs> when it comes to this fucking dog, you can just look at his little eyes. It's, 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 it's our fault. We didn't know that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you peed on the floor. It's so sweet. It's okay. You want a treat? We're sorry. That's how I feel about this dog. Uh, so I'm in this. Uh, relationship. It's a new relationship, but it feels like an old relationship because we, we like are one of those couples who progress like super, super fast. And I'm in LA, and I'm in a really healthy relationship with amazing and shocking. I was in New York before that. I did all the dating apps, and I dated some crazies. And also, I'm pretty sure my dad was 98.9% .9 that I was gay. Pretty sure. Which is fine, nothing wrong with it, but I recently when I started talking about his name is Brent, I started talking about it more often. He was just like, oh, is Brent your friend? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, he's my friend. He's like, oh, so then I sent him a picture of me and Brent. He's like, this is a good looking fella. <laughs> And then 
fucking rips the shit off. Oh. And so then when I'm trying to cover up leftover food, I have to like <laughs> fucking <laughs> put the shit to get the plastic wrap off. I don't understand it. And like when I showed her, I was like, babe, why is, you don't this is, you don't have to do this. It's like, oh <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 